The issue with hitting a new level in our writing careers is that next level often seems unachievable and impossible when we're first dreaming of it. So here's a trick which works for me because there was a time when all I thought was I would be happy if I could buy a few pizzas at the end of the month with my writing money and then it became uh, what if I could pay for all of our bills and then it became what if I could write for a living or live a very comfortable living and I'm actually trying to move to a new level which means to live my dream life and that too seems overwhelming to start with even for somebody like me uh, who has already achieved a lot. So wherever you are in your writing career, set that next goal level for yourself and make it something which is meaningful, not, you know, I'm making 50 bucks a month for my writing, I hope someday I can make 70 or 75. Be specific about a time and really push yourself. Like going from, you know, making a few bucks from your writing to paying for all your bills. If you're already at that level, then, you know, making an entire living from, from your writing. Or doing what I'm doing is trying to, to live your dream life. And to condition yourself to prepare for that journey, I encourage you to go through your life and find examples of where something seemed impossible and then you learned how to achieve it. It may be something simple like athletic events. Maybe you once thought that jogging around the block would be unachievable and now you run 5Ks. Uh, it could be something like uh, you didn't think that you would ever get back into reading and now you're reading 60 books a year. Uh, you know, just find little things in your life, whether it be from uh, when you were young or, or right now, um, and remember how that journey uh, took place and how silly it now seems to look back and, and have never believed that you could have done those things that you are doing. And that's how you condition yourself for moving to the next level.